A baseball team can always use more power. Minor League Baseball needs this boost. At Dunkin' Donuts Park, baselines and political lines have blurred. The focus? Helping minor league teams across the country. So there is no baseball, so there's no fans, there's no uh, ticket revenue, there's no sponsorship revenue, food and beverage revenue. Where the shortstop usually plays, a pitch from Senator Richard Blumenthal. Right now drafting legislation to provide relief for minor league clubs hit hard by COVID-19. Blumenthal's bill would aim to secure a half billion dollars that would be split between 120 minor league teams like the Yard Goats. There is nothing minor about minor league baseball. There is nothing minor about what it does for kids. There's nothing minor about what it does for downtown Hartford or countless cities and towns where restaurants and shops thrive because of minor league baseball. From the Yard Goats here in Hartford to teams all across the country, not one minor league team played a single inning of baseball in 2020. We haven't played baseball in 620 days, so it's been, it's been a, uh, a unique year, uh, and this is just one of the help, things to help recover and get us, uh, get us back to normal. A half a billion dollars is far less than the 28.6 billion that is going into the restaurant revitalization program but a half a billion dollars can help save minor league baseball. And in a divided D.C., perhaps it is on the baseball diamond where lawmakers can find common ground. I've talked to colleagues on both sides of the aisle. There's nothing that divides us about minor league baseball. We ought to come together and make a special effort. In Hartford, Jim Altman, Fox 61 News.